Iran launched over 180 missiles into Israel yesterday. It was a retaliation for a series of blows Israeli military landed in recent weeks against Hezbollah in Lebanon. Israel has vowed to respond with violent force, but it's unclear what that response will look like. NBC's Raf Sanchez reports from central Israel. Hey there, we're outside an elementary school in central Israel, and I just want to walk you through the scene here. This is where one of those 181 Iranian ballistic missiles came crashing down. This was a 10-foot crater. It has now been filled up by Israeli work crews, but the force of that explosion blasting through the wall of this classroom. And I want to show you around what, frankly, is kind of a ghostly scene. If you follow me in here, you can see these are the children who studied in this classroom. We think that they were seven, eight years old. And on the back wall, you can still see some of their drawings. Their artwork is hung up, a whiteboard where they were studying. And as you walk around, you can feel the crunch, hear the crunch of glass underneath. And it is instantly evoking of that what if thought. What if this classroom had been full of small children when that missile came crashing down just right there. Now, the Iranian missile attack happening at night, this classroom was empty, nobody was injured here, and almost miraculously, the Israeli government says there are no reports of anyone killed or seriously injured anywhere across Israel. There was one Palestinian man killed in the occupied West Bank when a piece of missile fell as a result of an interception overhead. The question now, how, when, and at what scale will Israel retaliate to this unprecedented attack? Earlier today, Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu meeting with his top intelligence and military officials, weighing that response. An Israeli official tells NBC News, Israel will respond swiftly. They are determined to show to Iran and the world that an attack like this will not go unanswered. After the last Iranian missile barrage back in April, there were five days in between the attack and then what was a very small-scale Israeli response. This Israeli official is indicating the response to come will be much larger, much more significant than that. And the scale of it and how the Iran responds may determine whether this region is hurtling towards all-out war. I'll send it back to you.